Hey everybody, it's me, Sean. Welcome back to Artificer, the science of magic. The magic of science? No, the science of magic, that's right. And I believe we were uh, on the search for some rocks. So let's see if we can find ourselves some rocks. Now, I sure would like to know what this does, but apparently that is not gonna help us. If we put it on, can we, uh, no? Hmm. All right, that's weird that it's showing me the, um, the uh, hotkeys, but you know, early development. What are you gonna do? A uh, little, little bit of a lag there. Oh, what is going on with the, um, with the lag? That's unusual. Eh, maybe it was just a matter of it first loading up. Um, not really finding any rocks here, fellas. I do see that lake up there, which I'm kind of tempted to go check out. I don't want to get lost though, but. Uh, lots of goodies up here. I guess I can collect this. I do need to, uh, yeah, I do need to get some more of that for um, whatever reasons. I think there's a, some like a spear or something like that, but that's also what I need the rocks for. <laughs> One of these days I'll get the rocks. Oh wait, I have the spear. I guess I need the rocks for a knife maybe? I don't know, hard to say, but we're gonna stop it. We're gonna Hey, keep keep pickaxing, pickaxing, would you? There we go. Great. And gather that stuff up since we're over here. I say, why don't you gather that up? There we go. Nice. Okay. And there should be some sand down there. Very good. All right. Now I don't want to get... Oh. Oh, shit. Get away from me. I'm not interested in fighting you. Okay. Let's uh, get back to our little diagonal path here. And keep an eye out for rocks. Oh, a different kind of tree. And it looks like a slightly different biome. Is that a rock? Nope. It's a rock lobster. Ha ha ha. Very funny. Uh, but that does mean some new um, research for us. Uh, clap trap. Okay, I probably don't want to touch that. Uh, error? What's this? Hmm. Seems dangerous. Well, I know that's a claptrap. I want to know what this lit up thing is. Maybe that's, I don't know. And these guys? Oh, no, that, wait. Weird. Could have swore that the, those are different things. And what's this? Witch cap. All right, well, I'll take that for sure. Be happy to gather up some witch caps. Um, a little hard to gather stuff when there's something in the way. Can't really gather anything from there. All right, well, I am definitely getting more and more off of my diagonal thing, so I'm gonna head back home. I don't like all these willow trees and stuff. Oh yeah, somebody in the comments asked if I would turn up the brightness. I'll go ahead and do that. This is, this is as bright as it gets, guys, so you know. Um, hopefully this is bright enough. It's still pretty dark though, and um, nothing I can do about that as you just saw, as I just showed. So I think we were up a little bit because I did go out of the way to get that rock. There we go. Need to watch out for the centipede there, although I do have a um, spear, but we don't really get any points or whatever for like killing centipedes, so really no point in uh, worrying about it. Dang it, I did not want to, uh, stop it! Didn't want to gather those things. They cut my hands up. I want to get a knife, and I want to find my way back to my little fort. But there we go, I have. Good job, me. Congratulations. So I have reoriented myself. Any construction I want to do here? Um, I've got those things. I could build a kiln, right? We've got logs. Plenty of clay. Oh, we don't have stone. There we go. We really want stone. Um, you know what I, I could be doing? Can I can can I set one sand down at a time? Apparently not. Ah, there we go. But I can't do it that way. Hmm. Well... 
because I sure would like to be able to leave myself a path that I can follow to get home, but it won't really allow me to set one thing down at a time. No, nope, that's all 30 of them. Try holding shift. No, nope, that won't do it. Try holding, doing the other key, the right key. Control doesn't do it. Alt doesn't do it. Well, I'm out of ideas. It was worth a shot. Again, with the little bits of lag, um, I don't know if you guys are seeing that or if it's just local. Sometimes the recording stuff will kind of record over those things. And continuing our little diagonal here. Um, hmm. Lots of stuff going on around this uh, lake here, but I'm not... Oh, what's this? More stone? Looks like it. Maybe I can use my pickaxe on it. Granite deposit. Okay, let's uh, see what happens. Am I going to knock stones off it? It looks like I am. Great. Okay. So I guess this is how you get stones once you get a little further in. Or basically away from the very start. So I'm surprised that centipede doesn't come try to get me. Don't really get as many stones as I had hoped. I don't know. I don't know how how uh, s s uh... ah dang it. Why am I not attacking him? The fighting in this is is weird, and I am taking a lot of damage. Attack him! Dang it. No, I don't need two of you guys. Uh, and I'm poisoned. Don't I have um don't I have bandages? No, because I don't have I don't know, whatever. I need to go back and, and figure out how to make some of those bandages. I Oh, that's right. I needed the stones to make the mortar and pestle. So we'll come back down here and uh, gather up the rest of those stones and hopefully fight off the uh centipedes. Maybe I can make that dagger. Um, the fighting thing is a little a little tricky. Do I need to do the R? No, R is for research. Huh. I feel like there was a um, little bit of instruction I received from the developer on how to, how to attack, and I don't remember it now. Um, okay, so, oh, I need shells to make that knife. Huh. And uh, algae bandage. Oh, I can make those. Ah, I need the mortar and pestle to m make the mush cane pulp. That's what it is. So if we keep on going. Oh, trail marker. Interesting. Weeping agaric. Oh, I have 16 of those. Great. And two logs. Jeez Louise, that's a lot. All right. Um. There we go, mortar and pestle, wildwood branch, stone, and logs. We have all those things. Good. Okay. So we'll place that right there, and then we'll go down and use that. And we should be able to mush up those things. There we go. Just be patient. And then we'll be able to take those and make bandages out of them, and then hopefully use those bandages. I'm not entirely sure how the bandaging thing works in this game. I've just like, I don't know how to use our, uh... oh wait, where did our little wreath go? What the, what happened to that? Did I set it down somewhere or something? Doesn't seem like I would have. Looks like I set it on the table, but that is something else. Hmm, it's unfortunate. Um, there we go, algae bandage. Uh, and do we have to, ah, good, we can craft multiples of them, so let's just go ahead and craft them all up. And I need more whatevers. All right, what did I need, these sword? I, I could make a rope, I don't know what I would do with it. Probably need the rope for, I would guess, um, uh, trapping. Let's go ahead and cut down some trees here. Get some more logs. Spooky noise. Oh, dang it. 
we may get to find out what that um all right saving is weird too back all right uh there we go so this is episode two all right we're gonna call it that and hit enter does that do it looks like it does it because it stopped flashing so i yeah like i said i'm not entirely sure how to use bandages um but i feel like we're going to want to <laughs> if we have to fight this stupid centipede maybe he'll just wander off but if he comes close I mean, I'm ready to attack him if it comes down to that. Yep, see, there you go. Get out of here, centipede. I said I was ready to attack you, but that is just not true. I am not ready to attack you. I don't want to die. If I do that, yep, I still gather up things. So I can't really turn it on. I'm gathering um, wood so I can make some trail, trail markers, I think. Oh, I've never examined that stump, huh? Yeah, no, I've examined that stump. Ah, I don't have the axe activated. I don't have it activated. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, let's, it's too bad it doesn't, I mean, I guess it's not really too bad, but I'm surprised it doesn't tell me what the, um, how much uh, uh, wear is on the axe. Also, I don't seem to have any sort of encum encumbrance um, limit. So I can just load up on all of this stuff if I want. I do love going around gathering things. Thank goodness you guys aren't watching me play Skyrim because all I do is uh, gather herbs all day and then make potions out of it and do that for about 20 straight hours. So, you know, that would be really entertaining if you guys were interested in watching that. Let's see. Now I could make some mush from like witch cap and other things. Um, but I won't. What I want to do is make some trail markers. That's right. Let's see. Let's see what those do. Uh, if we go to here and we go to the crafting thing and we skip through some of them. Standing torch, fireplace, trail marker. Great. All right. Oh, it gives me three of them. Hmm. I wonder. So if I place one there, all right, and then I place one there, that's it? That's all it does? Uh-oh, there's a bad guy. I do not want to mess with him. All right, go into my inventory. Can I do anything with the trail marker? I can make it flash. Well, that doesn't really help me any, does it? I have to make a whole lot of them if I'm going to have them this close together. I don't, and I can't, I can't pick it back up, can I? All right, well, good to know. I mean, I guess if I get lost, at least I can look for a trail marker and know that that's sort of parallel <laughs> to uh, where I'm going. How many times is it going to allow me to investigate and uh, examine things? I mean, I'm not complaining. I'll take the research points. But it does seem... I wonder if I can mush up logs to make pulp or something, which I would then make into paper? Dunno. Good question. Maybe I should try it. I mean, you have to kind of experiment to learn, right? It's like any good video game doesn't necessarily give you all the answers, but it gives you the ability to figure things out for yourself. I need mushrooms, or I need mushrooms to gather those knives. Let's try it the other way around. I need knives to gather up most of those mushrooms, like those morel looking things, like these bad boys over here. I definitely need a knife to gather that thing up, but I think I can gather that. And these centipedes just, ah, they really want to get me. And I would like to find some more stones. I feel like the stones that we had last time were kind of down here. And uh, if I'm not careful, I'm going to get lost. 
Was this that other lake that we found? And the stones were right near it. Yep, there we go. And there's our uh, that stupid centipede that I don't want to have to mess with. He's going to come get me. Get out of here. Leave me to my stone gathering, would you? I need to be careful because he can get me from behind those trees. Dang it. I need that stone. I don't even really need it, but I, since I'm down here, I don't want to leave it behind. And I think it resets the uh, resets the damage meter every time you... Ah! So you can't use them that way. No. Shoot. Oh, he's still over here, too. What is it? Do you just use the bandage like when you're dead or something? No, it doesn't do any good to click on there. What about over here? What is that? I don't even know what that is. It doesn't give me any meter. That's probably something you have to unlock or something. Centipede really seems to be leaving me alone now. Oh, there's a little troll monster guy. I have to keep an eye out for him. Whoa, what, do you, what were you... More stone? Probably. But I don't... I don't... I can't fight that centipede. Okay, let's head back to the base. And um, although we don't really have anything to manufacture yet, do we? I, I need shells to be able to make... Um, I need a knife to harvest that properly, yeah. I need shells to be able to make the... I don't know, whatever, uh, a knife. I'm not sure where I would get shells from. I can't really kill anything. Oh, there's more stone. That's nice. Gonna keep heading down here when we get into a more kind of a creepy area. We haven't changed the tree. T ah, shit. I cannot, uh, I can't fight off uh, the little troll guy. Thank goodness I saw him coming. All right, I'm going to head back to the main base. And, oh, there we go. Can't really make it through all those trees, huh? All right, well, good thing the monster's not right on top of me, or I probably would have been dead there. Gonna gather up these little guys while I'm passing by. And I see something moving over there, but it's probably one of those little pigs. Nope. Just gather up some of these algae things. <clears throat> they do look like they should be underwater. Hey, there's my uh my little pathfinder machine. Bink bink bink. It flashes when you click on it. Alright, so I'm glad that was there. Because I would have just kept going north. So, good job setting that up. All right. Well, um, I guess I could set up some additional trail markers. I've got plenty of, of those things. And I've got uh, quite a few logs as well. So, let's uh, do that. Those are real handy. I like it. So, there's a, a way to find our way around. Um, yeah, it would be nice to understand how to use the bandages. So this is, um, I believe this is a, oh, it doesn't say what it is, huh? All right. And I don't have any new research. I'm, I guess I could research trapping as well. We've got a lot of points, so no reason to not do it. I guess one reason to not do it would be because of the, the wood situation. All right. So no clues on these. There we go. Let's try this one. No, nope. must be that one then. Nope, that one. All right. And, um, okay, trapping research complete. Very nice. Don't know what that does for us. Does it, does it tell us what it does? No, it just has a little cute little description. Mm. And I still haven't figured out the heat treatment thing either. So can we do anything with sand? No. 
We cannot. Can I do anything with this dotted algae? No. How about laminar? No. Logs? Ah, sh get out of here. Centipede. I'm going to save it again. Did, it, did I save it? I think I did. Ah, it's so confusing. I think once it starts, there we go. There we go, so it's saved up. All right. Um, well, I do not like that centipede over here. You know what? We're going to find out how the... Uh, stop it. That's not what I wanted to do. We're going to find out how the bandages, if they work automatically when you... Nope, they don't. Okay. Well, that answers that. So how the heck do you use bandages? strange. I need to figure figure that one out. E doesn't do anything. That doesn't do it. All right, well, I'll see if I can figure it out uh, in between episodes. Um, I do have a link to their Discord. I could go there and ask, or I'm sure somebody else has already asked about it. Seems like that would be a pretty common question. Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, how do you heal yourself? Um, so I need stones, and we have our little trail markers. So that's nice. It'll make it really easy to find our way back home when we're uh, on our way somewhere, especially if I kind of set them up in the cardinal directions. It'd be nice if I could set them up a little, I mean, I guess I could set them up a little closer to each other. I'm the only one who uh, would prevent that from happening, but I'm not going to. Uh-oh, I don't like a troll monster over there. Oh, there's another one too. Can't be placed here because of the swamp. I see. So there's different ground types. All right. Um, get out of here. No. Nope. Go back in. There we go. Thank you. All right. Well, it looked like he stopped chasing me. Huh. So I am going to see if I can find out how to use uh, bandages. And um, yeah. Uh, thank you so much, everybody, for watching. I really appreciate you joining me for this uh, episode and this new series. Uh, we'll be back with another episode real soon. If you've enjoyed this, uh, click that like button and uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. I'd love to hear from you. And I'll see you next time. Bye.